Hey there, Chargers, King here, and today we'll be doing uh, Stoneblock 3, which was recently updated with my friend Muzz when he gets back from being deaf and muted when he was waiting for me because I had issues loading this on Curse Forge. I had to actually use the Beast Launcher. Yeah. But now it's working, we got the server set up, and I'll see you guys when we start the video. Hey guys, Chargers, King here. Uh, Muzz is muted right now, but uh, I. I always set the server because I, we were supposed to choose this one. That one, the bottom, but I accidentally chose the wrong one. I'll show you. Uh, we were supposed to choose this one, but I accidentally chose this one. You probably say, why don't you wait for MUDS? Hey guys, we're in the world or the area we wanted. We wanted this house because we kind of just liked it. It has a free bed. But uh, let me show you guys has the fireplaces and stuff if we go out here you see all of this stuff like the load berries stuff we we would just want this just because of these because look we can do shifting and we can make them grow which is nice and it's a good early game food source we have played this mod pack before but i think it was like the 2.0 version of it but yeah let's start you guys are just stuck with me for right now, so... So how this mod pack works is that we're in a cave and each of them is a different layer. So this right here in the middle layer where we are, this is where only there's only cobblestone, no, not cobblestone, only stone and a little bit of dungeons. Out, out more right here is when we start getting ores and cave system. Beyond that is, is the nether layer and this and beyond that is the end layer. If I remember correctly, there are a thousand blocks each. So if we go a thousand blocks, then we reach the mining level, a thousand, a thousand. So we will have probably make have a, a uh, ton of bore. But other than that, let's get started, I guess. I have a team made. Yeah, I'll make me make some new join events, do that. Getting started. Break some stone with your bare hands. Like a caveman? You don't even give you a fool? How rude. Okay, if I remember correctly, we can make a stone crafting table. Yes. I need to place it right there. And then after that, I think we get a random reward. Ooh, and a side casing. The muzzle will love that. And a crafter tier one. And then we can make a hammer. Can we do that? Then do that. That. Let me do that. Yummy, yummy, yummy. And this looks like a pickaxe, guys, so we can get actual cobblestone other than having to do the stone, the stone method until we get a pickaxe, which should be coming up soon because I'm pretty sure we have to make dirt and sheave dirt to get saplings. That should be if a user cooked to, uh, to pretty much harvest, if I remember correctly. Do that. Do that. And I can make a cobblestone chip. Just like that. And like that, we get so many achievement stuff. Did I actually get two hoppers? Or... No, I got my eight hoppers. What the? That was that was so lucky, guys. Get seed, just a quick on dirt, change the chance. And if I remember correctly, I'm just gonna use nine.
I'm not picking up that side. Oh, the good sapper is next to the bad that way. Yeah. I'm not touching that. I would never touch a birch sapling. Never. As long as I live, I would never touch that sapling. I need to put Oh, where is he? Yeah, we got a tree. Oh, it's a big tree, too. What I got? And, oh, it's the one yet, too. Ultimize not activated. Uh, do I need to make an axe? I'll make an axe in a minute. Give me a minute. I'm going to do that. Get enough for an axe if I can drop the tree down. I'm going to do that. Do that, that. Make an actual pickaxe. Okay. Yeah, I can do that. And back and say hi. Ooh. That's not bad. I'll keep this as a sword. Yeah, this is my weapon for right now. Sword. Make the port builder right there. Put it on this end. Okay. Do that, and now we can make a little bit cool. I almost was so close to that where I can actually pick it up. That would have been awful. Ooh, that's actually really good for the beginning. Oh god, that, yeah, that is good. We could, oh, this takes me so time for my bubble stuff. Oh my god, so much time. Now, Melter, and I'm more than sure we have to go this route. And we need andesite, and if I remember correctly, andesite's kind of pain. Yeah. I'm just gonna do it. If you guys don't know what the impact hammer does, it mines a 3x3x3 three by three by three, as it says. It's like this. See? You probably think it's iron set right here. I just don't want to mine. What? The, that worked? I'm going to try to make this down to Andesite level, so... And like that, we made to Andesite level. Okay, guys. Uh, I'm back. Uh, I got some food. Mm, gimme. My characters are so hungry. I really don't mean I can beat him. What am I gonna make? And because we have this now, we can start making cool armor. I'm making uh, blah, 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 ores who can actually do stuff. Because we're going to need to make a. If I want this to go by itself, where I don't have to actually manually do it, I'm going to need a water wheel. Which, which this, we need some zinc or iron. And iron seems like the easiest one to get for Earth right now. And what you guys do is put it in there, and you crank. It uses your hunger though, so this is very, very uh, recommended to do unless it's automa automated. But I just need some iron, like at least w one or two ingots. There's my friend Mug, guys. He finally showed up after I start automating create. So I'm gonna leave her. 
Where's my invite to the party? Oh my god, the desk. Or the chairs. The desk is too high up. Invite players. There you go. Oops. You have to see. Hmm? Why did you not clear up this area? Right. Go jump the hole. It's down the hole. Do you want to complain? Kill that slime, by the way, before he kills you. What slime? Oh. The one beside you. <laughs> I just thought this could be like the little beginning area. I wish Rick was here so I can just make him do this by himself. I need more food. Here. It's not much, but it is food. The berries. That's true. Why haven't you automated the fact that it will go out of the thing? And go in automatically. And all we have to do is hit turn the crank. I could. Because I do have hoppers. A lot of hoppers. <laughs> oh, you don't even need hoppers. Well, and I see we have the stuff to make at least one water wheel. It'll be slow, but it'll be a task. Oh, that's what I was uh, talking to the uh, audience about before you unmuted. I was just say... I want to make the water work so we can just have this automatically where the only thing we have to do is just automate it to have gravel inside it and we do nothing but be lazy. I mean, here, let me go get the stuff. I'll just make a... Do you want a large one? Spin slower but gives you more power? Or just a small one? Here. I mean, a small one will work. Here. Here's this. This. I'm trying to get a water I bucket. There. I'm trying to get a water bucket. We also need a cauldron, so we need... We need a water bucket, dude. I know, let me at least make this somewhat of an area for it. Last time, love me a train that went all the way out. You made the train. I didn't make the tr You made the tracks, you made the tunnel bore. I, was, I told you. I'm... I told you, Muzz, I think we're going a little too far. And he's like, it'll be fine, we need to go out this far anyway. Yeah. Do. You already went past the the end area. You wanted to go five thousand blocks out, but no apparently. No, no each there's area is a, a thousand. There's a thing outside. Nope. Did they change it finally? No, each layer is like a thousand blocks. I just got a vile sword. Oh, I have that too. It's a good beginner weapon. I found out. Okay. Now, let me do that. And there. Yep, there we go. It's not overly efficient, but it works. Yeah. Water and lava. Yeah. I got this and this. Oh my god. Is it better to get eight poppers? I got eight poppers in a row, dude. <laughs> Do you have another bucket on you? Uh, look in the furnace. There should be iron in there. Okay, we got it. I have to remember what Muzzle complains about. He doesn't go this way. If I'm correct. Okay, uh, how do you make a reverse? How do you make this reverse? Move the water or? Uh, no, wait. 
Well, yeah, you can do that. Thank you. That's one way of doing it. Oh, look what I got as a reward. Too bad none of us know how to use both hands, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you think this will work, or do you think this will burn by lava? Well, one way to find out. And there he goes on another adventure. I do that in case. There is again top of it. It looks fine. Okay. So at least now we can actually smell a stack of stuff, right? Nope, and now we can wash. Mm-hmm. Okay, you smell some stuff because okay after that's done i'm gonna wash the sand get okay. gold i think we should have made this a wash or not smelter we have furnaces yeah not until we get i mean it smelts at the same pace even at full speed so yeah uh we just need more of them like um one on each side actually smelts it a lot faster, and I'm gonna make an on max smelter so like, thing later. Like one right here too, because right here. No, there, there, and above. Nah. Because I'm gonna make one that's uh, made for a belt, so that way we can actually uh, automate all the stuff. Wait, do we even need the milling stone anymore? Uh, technically, yes, for now. What do you plan to use? Crushing wheels that we don't have? No. Because, yeah, we can get iron from gravel. We just have to put it in the lot. Yes, but how do you plan to get sand? Do you want to hammer it every time? Because I mean, we don't have an auto hammer right now. I mean, is that better than nothing? Do we just need sand right now? Yeah, we just really need uh, some sand to finish up that little portion. I just got four item pipes. Why haven't you made the melter? I'm gonna do the smart thing that all YouTubers do. Right now, I'm gonna stop my recording and restart it, so in case my footage corrupts, I don't lose all of it. Mm, that's fair. I need to get into that habit of doing that. It's in the hole. And the site? Yeah. Right by me. Are you in the hole? Yes. By the way, if you, by the way, if you just look up, it's fast that they didn't actually climb it up. By the way, drop something. <laughs> it's too hard. No, it's stuck in the web. Drop something. Just give it a minute. How long do we wait? There's a few seconds. Right there, there it goes. Mythical orange. Mythical. How do you more make botania. this go? Let me guess, you need like a speed controller to make this go faster, right? Uh, that or we wait and I can make a... I can gear shift it. Okay.
I, I just want to complete that quest. So Project E is the end game. Yep. Do the fun way attack to make stuff. And we kind of want to finish the series for once, don't we? Oh, good God. Wow, I, I just looked at how to make the table. Yeah. I think the other thing we should also try to make is the cosmic sword. Right, like... Probably. Uh, let's see. To make the... You know what we should also try to make? As a challenge, the cosmic meatball Wait, by the end of course, the fetch. series. Yeah, beyond the end ring is where the where you can summon the silverfish boss. I went to forever doing it for us to figure it out. And it, you know what's more embarrassing was? Is when it it was so easy and we just overthink it, didn't we? Yeah, we do overthink a lot. That way. Well, here's a question. Here's a question. Can you give me some dust. Give me a minute. Uh, can you compress the block? Like, can we break with the hammer? That's a good question. Yeah, you can. Okay, this will be. You know what I really hate? I wish that in this version they use sophisticated storage. What do they use? Iron chest. That's not bad. I used to use iron chest. Yes, but sophisticated actually has the stuff upgrades you can put in and the stack upgrade that saves our life. Uh, then again, I'm recording the videos of freaking ATM nine. So I, I've kind of got used to that second nature videos coming out soon, by the way. Oh, for your channel. Well, I was going to post it on my channel and the group channel. Me mm -hmm. I remember on the group channel, put a re upload it and we reload your thing just so so uh, people don't report it thinking you're a uh, channel trying to copy us. People do that a lot. Yeah. I'll put re upload on the group channel. Because. Or should I put re upload on mine? It's up to you. But the reason I say that is because some people will say, like, this guy, these people, this kid trying to copy this big group channel and report you. That's the only reason I mention it. Because it happens a lot to most YouTube YouTubers mm -hmm. that do we uploads. You know what? Uh, if you're smart, what you do is after six years, unpost your video on your group channel and we upload it. You might think I'm being a scumbag, but that's what most YouTubers are doing nowadays. I mean, it's a good strategy if you just lazy and make videos, right? Oh, if you're not feeling well, it's good to have a re-upload just to put out there. Just put in the description you were you're sick, and it might just be a few days of re-uploads. Yeah. Just yeah, to bring back the good old days. And most people don't know your old videos because people don't look beyond like a year's time of a YouTube channel. Dust. Why did I pick that sand? The sand. Wait, I'm the one with the texture pack. How did you not know that? I'm blind. Yeah, you want to tell the audience how did you make yourself blind? Okay. I I, I have no shame in the story. Uh, when I was younger, after soccer practice, you know you don't have to do that with the water wheel, right? But after soccer practice, I would lay in the back seat car or just lay down in general i would look up and look at the sun until it rolled over turning blue yeah do you not know how to okay 
you not know how to throw them all out at the same time? It it is control. Control shift Q. Yeah. No, for me it's shift Q. No shift button. I have a uh, I have a hotkey on my uh, mouse that I can just do uh, control and my drop key. Yeah, I, I know I wasn't on a lot, but that's fine. Either way, in editing, you've been here for half the video. <laughs> that, that's fair. <laughs> well, that's it for today. But yeah, guys. <laughs> it's been Char and Muzz. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>